time, the final frontier. Not because it's something we have to conquer, but something we need to understand about ourselves and the universe. As many of you probably know, plasma makes up 99.9% .9 of the known universe. And the way plasma moves is going from a negative polarity, which you could think of as agitation, towards a positive polarity, which we could think of as stillness or a return point. This movement of trying to find equilibrium is actually what drives the universe. As you could say, negative energy or negative charged particles or energy is constantly trying to find its way to lose that agitation as the universe wants to find balance. That balance is in stillness. So when something moves from a negative polarity to a positive polarity, it's moving over what we call time because from our perspective, we're inside of that circuit. However, imagine you aren't inside that circuit and you're some sort of disincarnated intelligence observing the whole process from a higher space-time dimension. But what you would see is more of a flat surface with agitation bubbling up over time. And that agitation, which we call different beings, different energetic signatures and matter, would not really cease to exist, but return back to that stillness point. At which point it then flattens out and kind of moves around to the point where it again will gather different spins on top of each other and then rise up again as discrete ripples on top of this flat surface. This is exactly how our universe works, ourselves included. If you'd like to learn more about this and how plasma structures the universe, check out the other videos in my profile or check out my website.